as the Hereford Traffic Forum, you've actually met with the highways agency who control this stretch of road. What, what sort of, I suppose, hope have they given you? Are they willing to listen? They've actually been very good. Credit to them. There's a couple of guys we've been dealing with there, and they have been very, very good. And they are basically saying to us that if there's a political will, they will look at it closely. This is their responsibility, but they are in a city, and they have to be respectful to the authority that's there. So we have then tried to approach the council, they weren't interested. So we're now looking at alternative um, sort of administrations coming in shortly who are much more inclined to look at this and are happy to look at this and are happy to look at solving Hereford's traffic problems sensibly. Of course there is planning going in for a link road between the A49 and the A465, the two biggest roads south of us, that would link them together. Do you not think that would alleviate the traffic? No, I don't. I, I don't think the link roads have got anything to do with alleviating traffic and we know that. The council had themselves have said it's to do with unlocking land for development. So it's got nothing to do with solving our problems. Dumping uh, more houses once the link roads are built is not going to help our, our, our issue here. It's got nothing to do with it whatsoever. The, the, the highways agency have said that 12 to 15 percent of the traffic only is through traffic. So everyone is actually trying to get into Hereford. Having a bypass, like in Worcester, won't make much of a difference. People say it will, though. I hear day in, day out from relatives, from friends, from colleagues, oh, what we need is a bypass. Do you think it's become a bit of an urban myth? I think it's become a council myth, to be honest. And, and I mean, I say that quite bluntly, and I'm, I'm not being unkind. They are trying to push a narrative that if we have a bypass, it's going to solve all our problems. It isn't. The bypass is to build houses. We know that. It's to unlock land. It's not going to help the traffic problem we have coming through the centre of town because everyone wants to get to work. If we have a school holiday, you can see the difference it makes. As couriers, we can see that suddenly the traffic flows so much easier and it's a fraction of the amount of traffic on the road. The council should be concentrating on decent public transport systems and not worrying about link roads and all the associated apparent benefits which simply don't exist and are not borne out. John Harrington making some uh, forceful points there. He's from the Hereford Transport Forum uh, at the Belmont Roundabout with Nicola Goodwin this morning. Thanks for your text. Uh, whilst you're listening to that mass in Hereford. Traffic always flows with the traffic lights out. Even better if people walked. It would help the traffic and people's health as well. Any more you can add to that. So listen to some of the solutions, uh, some of the points that John Harrington was making there. Uh, More with Nicola uh, in Hereford City Centre after eight on the show.